Have you ever wondered what millionaires really live like? The Millionaire Next Door, a best-selling book, challenges our assumptions about what it means to be wealthy. The book reveals that many of the millionaires in America are actually frugal, hard-working individuals who have built their wealth over time by living below their means, investing wisely, and building businesses. In this video, we will explore the key takeaways from The Millionaire Next Door. We will look at the book's core concepts and principles. Whether you are an aspiring entrepreneur or simply looking to gain a new perspective on wealth building and financial planning, the insights from The Millionaire Next Door are sure to be valuable. So, let's dive in and explore the key takeaways from this groundbreaking book. Takeaway number one, live below your means. Most millionaires in America are not flashy spenders who live in mansions and drive luxury cars. Instead, they are frugal individuals who live in modest homes, drive used cars, and are disciplined with their spending habits. They prioritize saving and investing their money over conspicuous consumption. Living below your means allows you to save money and invest it in income-producing assets such as stocks, real estate, and businesses. The authors found that many millionaires were able to accumulate their wealth by living well below their means and saving and investing consistently over time. The book offers several practical strategies for living below your means, such as creating and sticking to a budget, avoiding debt, and being mindful of your spending habits. It also emphasizes the importance of being content with what you have and not succumbing to the temptation to keep up with the Joneses. Takeaway number two, invest wisely. Firstly, the book emphasizes the importance of having a long-term approach to investing. The authors found that many millionaires invest in stocks, real estate, and businesses for the long haul, rather than trying to make quick profits. By taking a long-term approach, you can avoid making impulsive decisions and focus on building a solid investment portfolio over time. Secondly, the book stresses the importance of diversification. Investing all your money in a single asset or investment strategy can be risky, as your entire portfolio could be wiped out if that asset performs poorly. Finally, the book advocates for keeping investment costs low. High investment fees and commissions can eat into your returns over time reducing the amount of money you have available to invest. The author suggests choosing low-cost index funds and exchange-traded funds, ETFs, as a way to keep your investment costs to a minimum. Takeaway number three, financial literacy. The authors found that many millionaires are self-made, and a key factor in their success was their financial literacy. These individuals had a strong understanding of money management, investing, and other financial concepts, which helped them make informed decisions about their finances. The book provides several examples of millionaires who actively sought out financial education, whether through books, seminars, or other means. By educating themselves about money management and financial planning, they were able to make smarter decisions about their investments, avoid costly mistakes, and ultimately build their wealth over time. In addition to education, the book also stresses the importance of discipline and self-control when it comes to managing your finances. By living below your means, avoiding excessive debt, and saving and investing consistently, you can build wealth over time and achieve financial independence. Takeaway number four, persistence. The authors found that many millionaires had achieved their success through hard work, discipline, and persistence. These individuals were often self-employed or owned their own businesses, and they worked long hours and made significant sacrifices to achieve their goals. In addition to hard work, the book stresses the importance of discipline when it comes to managing your finances. Millionaires often live below their means, avoiding excessive debt and unnecessary expenses, and instead focus on saving and investing consistently over time. The book provides several examples of individuals who worked hard and practiced discipline in their finances, ultimately achieving financial independence and becoming millionaires. However, the book also notes that there is no guarantee of success, and that even with hard work and discipline, there are no guarantees in life. Nonetheless, the lessons on hard work and discipline are critical for achieving success in any field, including building wealth. Takeaway number five, build a business. The authors found that a significant percentage of millionaires were business owners or self-employed individuals who had built their wealth through entrepreneurship. These individuals had identified a need in the market and created a business that addressed that need, often through hard work and dedication over many years. 
The book provides several examples of successful entrepreneurs who had created businesses that ultimately generated significant wealth for themselves and their families. However, the book also notes that building a successful business requires a great deal of hard work, dedication, and risk-taking. Many entrepreneurs fail multiple times before achieving success, and building a business is not a guaranteed path to wealth. Nonetheless, for those with the skills and determination to succeed as entrepreneurs, building a business can be a highly effective way to create wealth and achieve financial independence. In conclusion, The Millionaire Next Door provides valuable insights into the habits and practices of successful millionaires, whether you're just starting out on your financial journey or looking to improve your existing habits, the lessons from this book can provide valuable guidance and inspiration. By adopting the habits and practices of successful millionaires, you can increase your chances of achieving financial independence and building lasting wealth over time. I hope you take the lessons from this book and become very successful. Thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe or you will die. Goodbye.